Monday, June 24th, 2026, 7.30 p.m. It was my brother's birthday, and we were getting the party ready, but I needed to distract my brother until the party was ready, so me and him went out shooting water bottles. I'm still better than you, my brother joked. Only by one point, I said. It was seven to eight, and we had set up twenty water bottles. So far, my brother shot eight, and I shot seven. By 7.56 p.m., we were tied 10 to 10, when I got a text from my dad saying that the party is ready. So we started packing up to go back. Hey, Josh, I gotta go take a leak. Can you watch over his stuff, please? I asked. Sir, just be quick, he said. I ran out of sight of my brother and went behind a bush. Once I got done, I was about to go back to the car when I saw someone walking in the field of grass. He was looking down at the ground, so I thought he was looking for something. So being the nice person I am, I shouted, Hey, are you looking for something? Do you need any help? Then he just stopped, and with one swift, bone crack move, he turned his head up to me, and what I saw was petrifying. He had a shadow-like body. He was also wearing a Megalon costume, with blood on parts of his body. He also had blood on the tip of his drills, horn, on his feet, on his antennas, and his eyes were punched in and had dark, soulless-like eyes, but he had bright white, human-like pupils and had blood dripping from his eyes and mouth. His mouth was wide open and didn't move, and with a dark, deep voice, it spoke to me. Hello, human. Do you come out here every night? If so, that's great. It gets lonely out here. Blood splat out of his mouth as he spoke. That was enough for me to run back to the car and see my brother. Get in the car now! I shouted. Why? he asked. At that very moment, I saw his eyes look out to the field, and he was freaked, because the thing was watching us. We both got into the car, and I looked up in the rearview mirror, and that thing was not moving. It kept watching us, but I didn't care. I stepped on the gas pedal and took off. Is that thing following us? I asked. Josh looked in the rearview mirror and said, No. On the way back, I kept thinking about that thing. But the rest of the night, nothing else happened. The party went as planned, and I was about to go to bed. I heard a voice in my head said, I'll see you soon. It was him. Happy Halloween.